Non-stop action until about 9.45 tonight. And if we're not on TBJ, we will be on TBJ SN or OneSpotMedia.com. So buckle up. Liston in four, Tina Clayton in five. Away they go. Tina Clayton caught up well, but Brianna Liston responds to her brilliantly and covers the Edwin Allen athlete in blue. Brianna Liston runs a fantastic curve and transitions beautifully in the straightaway. Will she go for the record? Tina Clayton has been blown away, so is the rest of the field. This is a superb effort coming in from Brianna Liston. Look at the clock. It's a wonderful performance. She absolutely demolishes the record. That is the greatest 200 performance we've seen at Girls Champs in Class 4. If the wind is legal, she no. has just oh, produced not. something out it, of this world. Well, it's not a record, but guess what? It is still the fastest we've ever seen in class four. Positive 2.2 meters per second is the win. I mean, it looks spectacular. She clearly went for the record. I'm going to give you some numbers shortly, but here she is. Brianna Liston enters the home straight and she lifts and she pushes. She knows she's a record holder at 24 flat. She wanted to improve that. It's easier to run it on a Friday evening than on a Saturday afternoon. A Thursday but evening. I don't know, I don't know. You're, 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 you're heading back to the future. <laughs> there she goes. But she looks relaxed as well, and that is what is uh, critical here, because even though she went flat out, a little bit of grimace there, but she she's is pressing hard, but she looks fresh yes. enough after that effort. Plus she 2. is 2. no 0. normal class four athlete. The, the record in class three and two, uh, 23, one, one, and 23, one, three. She ran 23, four, six, is, four, six is not a meet record. It's not a win legal time. Right, so we need to, it's not a record folks, uh, the following wind, uh, the, the, the. And uh, has performed creditably uh, Clayton as they head to their blocks and uh, we head over to Ricardo Chambers. Tina, her twin sister, Tia, picked up a medal in 100 last night. She would long to get a medal in the 200 today. Brianna Liston is the outstanding favorite. Can she go sub-24 with all the running she's already done? Clean break first time for the Class 4 girls 200 meters final. Brianna Liston is already off to a great start. Covers Mackinac on her outside and goes off to faster from Mount Alvernia. Sweeps around her as well. Tina Clayton is running a good race. Edwin Allen on the outside. But Brianna Liston is in command of the field. Mackinac of Idel is back in second. Brianna Liston is dominating the field. Watch the clock. That's what we're talking about. Brianna Liston to the line. There is the record now. She didn't get it in the semifinal because of the win. But for the first time at girls championship a class four girl breaks 24 seconds legally wonderful performance from Brianna Liston she's your sprint of a champion she is your 200 record holder and she is one of the darlings of girls championships 2017 as you were to have said uh uh, Ricardo, she has gone in untarted territories. 23, going below 24 seconds uh, Earl, Phenomenal performance. I told you about her. Real speed, real speed. Yeah. Uh, exceptional performance by this young lady. Absolutely fast young lady. That's uh, Brianna Liston. Uh, of course, she's not a big uh, person. She's not a, uh, uh, somebody that looks like a Kevona Davis, who is quite uh, physically much more imposing. But certainly, this, that's a race there. And uh, Brianna Liston just went out like a, a rocket. And she just went away about her business. Uh, as you know, she had been running hard all week. You can't teach the class four at least to, 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 to go slow. I mean, if she wants to go fast, she's going to go fast. She ran 24 46 in the semifinals. The win was a little bit uh, 23, over. 46. 33, uh, 23 46. The win was 2.1. Just, just missed the record there. Not many class three athletes or class one athletes will run 23.69. That is a wonderful performance from Brianna Liston. We've been hearing about her from primary school and she's arrived on the big stage. Great performance again by Brianna Liston. Congratulations to Coach Goburn and his staff at St. Diego High School. For the final uh, placings, uh, Coach... ...record at this moment, young Brianna Liston, back with her Snapchat look, believes that she 
and break 1175, which belongs to another San Diego athlete, Kimon Shaw. Ran 12.09 in the semis into a heavy headwind. The record is under threat. Brianna Liston in four, her teammate Nemhard in five. Vasa Montalvernia three. San Diego expects a Quinella. Final of the 100 meters, class four girls. Oh, with it, goal. Liston didn't get a bad start. She's right up with the field at the start. Nemhard is close and so is Vassil. She starts to separate herself now. Brianna Liston away and clear. San Diego one, two, watch the clock, Liston. Up 12, but St. Jago did exactly what they wanted. Gold and silver. St. Jago with a quinella here at Girls Champs as we begin seven super 100 meter races. The record 11.75, her final time 11.86. But another magnificent performance that gets the St. Jago fans dancing. Better before high school at 400, her start not so bright and quick. Gets out with a pack, that's the best she normally does. Here she is in the middle of the field, starting to reach out and sprint forward. A teammate goes with her, San Diego 1 2. On the very inside, Weber Woolman's looking really good at this stage. Basil tries to come through to get a medal, but this is Brianna Liston, great at 200, and here takes the first half an expected sprint double. Off the gas early, Bruce could have gone faster. I suspect so. The first thing she wanted to confirm was a victory. The second thing was that her teammate got that silver medal. She's going to take the look to the right. She doesn't worry about anybody on her left. Is my teammate second? Yes, we did it. Quinella, St. Diego, 16 points. 11.86, 12.08 for Nemhard, and 12.28, it's Tia Clayton who comes through to get the bronze ahead. In four, in blue, also go out quickly, try to close down on St. Jago, Immaculate also run a very good first leg, the change is made, St. Jago in command down the back straight away, Brianna Liston the sprinter with champion is speeding and she is pouring the field apart look at her go, here she comes now to the second change over St. Jago in command, Edward Allen trying to keep up with them can they, they're coming back on this third leg, this could be a great finish, St. Jago and Edwin Allen, here's the final change one of the Clayton twins on the inside St. Jago, Edwin Allen here's a tremendous battle, Edwin Allen on the inside, St. Jago on the outside it's St. Jago wonderful effort, tremendous race, but it's gold to St. Jago and silver to the Edwin Allen girls and they celebrate again that looks like a record, yeah, and they celebrate, they celebrate, trying to see if we can actually see the final time, 46.34 smashes Edwin Allen's 46.65 from 2015, another record shattered in Kingston. The girls continue to impress, St. Diego getting the job done. But we see when we look at the replay,